5 Reasons to Buy Caspa Now Welcome back, future thinkers. I've got a secret for you today. A technological blueprint that's flying so low under the radar, it's practically a submarine. You absolutely cannot afford to pause this video, not even for a second, because the most crucial piece of this puzzle, the real secret to Caspa's potential, waits for you at the very end. We are going on a deep dive journey here, and every single step of this explanation builds to that final game-changing reveal. Before we dive into why Caspa is the definitive 2025 contender, smash that like button, hit subscribe and ring that notification bell right now. Seriously, do it. Your future self will thank you for making sure you don't miss our next deep dive. So, buckle up, grab your coffee or your energy drink, and let's dive into why Caspa is turning heads right now. Now, I know what you're thinking. Another crypto project, another blockchain claiming to be revolutionary. You've heard it all before, right? But here's the thing about Caspa that makes it genuinely different, and I'm going to walk you through this step by step so it all clicks together. By the time we reach the end, you're going to understand exactly why this matters, so stay focused, because we're building towards something big here. Caspa is a blockchain that launched on November 7, 2021, and from day one it's been doing things differently. No fancy pre-mine where insiders get rich before you even hear about it. No exclusive token sale where venture capitalists buy in at pennies and dump on retail investors later. Everyone started from the same line. You, me, miners, developers, everyone. That's already refreshing in a space where most projects feel rigged from the start, but keep watching because this fair launch connects to something much bigger I'll reveal at the end. Most blockchains work like a single file line at the grocery store. One block gets processed, then the next one, then the next one. It's orderly, sure, but it's also painfully slow when the line gets long. Caspa throws that whole system out the window. Instead of making blocks, wait their turn. Caspa lets multiple blocks get created at the same time. Think of it like opening up 10 checkout lanes instead of one. And before you ask how that doesn't create chaos, just hang tight because the way Caspa solves that problem is actually brilliant, and it's reason number one on our list. But we're not there yet. I need you to understand the foundation first, so don't click away. The architecture Caspa uses is called Block DAG, and this is where things get interesting. Stay with me here because this gets technical for a second, but I promise I'll make it simple, and you absolutely need to understand this part to appreciate where we're heading. Traditional blockchains create a linear chain, like links connected one after another. If two miners create blocks at the same time, the network picks one winner and throws the other away. All that computing power, all that electricity, wasted. Caspa says no to waste. Instead of discarding competing blocks, Caspa keeps them all and arranges them using a set of rules that everyone agrees on. It's like instead of picking one winner in a race, you record everyone's time and create a complete picture of what happened. This is our first major reason to consider Caspa, and remember we're building towards something specific so keep watching. Reason number one, block DAG architecture enables real scalability. This isn't theoretical. Caspa already creates blocks every single second. Not every 10 minutes like Bitcoin, not every 12 seconds like some other chains. Every single second. And research shows it can go even faster, moving towards sub-second block times. For you as a user, this translates to near-instant confirmations. You send a payment, and seconds later, it's confirmed. No waiting around wondering if your transaction went through. No paying premium fees to jump the line. The network handles high activity without breaking a sweat, and as more people use Caspa, it doesn't slow down like congested highways during rush hour. It scales up naturally. But here's the thing, speed without security is worthless, which brings us to reason number two. Keep watching because these pieces are connecting. Reason number two, ghost DAG and proof of work provide reliable security. Now, you might be wondering how Caspa stays secure when it's processing blocks so quickly and keeping multiple blocks at once. Great question, and this is where the genius really shows. Caspa uses the same proven security model as Bitcoin, proof of work. This has protected billions of dollars for over a decade. It's battle-tested. It works. But Caspa enhances it with an algorithm called Ghost DAG. This algorithm can handle multiple blocks simultaneously while still reaching agreement on one single transaction history that everyone trusts. No double spending, no confusion, no security compromises. And here's something that'll make you smile. Caspa uses its own mining algorithm called K-Heavy Hash, which sounds like a heavyweight boxing championship for computers, right? But seriously, 
It's designed to spread mining power across many participants instead of concentrating it in a few giant farms. More decentralization means more security, and that means your investment has a solid foundation. But we're not done yet, not even close. The next reason is where Caspa really starts to separate itself from the pack, so don't you dare pause this video. Reason number three, high throughput and low latency for real use cases. Listen, anyone can promise fast transactions in a demo environment, but Caspa has actually demonstrated processing up to 5,584 transactions per second in testing, with block times as fast as 0.1 seconds. Let me put that in perspective. Bitcoin processes around 7 transactions per second, Ethereum does maybe 30, Caspa is playing in a completely different league. And these aren't theoretical numbers. This is happening right now at the base layer. No complicated second layers, no lightning networks, no roll-ups, just pure, straightforward performance. Think about paying for your coffee with cryptocurrency. With most chains, you'd be standing at the counter for minutes waiting for confirmation. With Caspa, it's nearly instant. Gaming, microtransactions, daily purchases, all practical, all feasible. This makes Caspa genuinely usable in the real world, not just as digital gold sitting in a wallet, but you know what matters just as much as technology? Trust. And reason number four is all about trust. Stay tuned, because we're almost at the big reveal. Reason number four, fair launch and strong community development. Remember how I mentioned earlier that Caspa launched without a pre-mine or insider allocations? This isn't just a nice philosophical point, it fundamentally changes the incentives of everyone involved. When a project pre-mines coins for founders and early investors, those people have a built-in advantage. They got in cheap and they're often just waiting for the right moment to cash out and dump on everyone else. You've seen it happen, we all have. Caspa eliminated that problem from day one. Every single coin was introduced through mining. Equal opportunity for everyone. This builds genuine trust because miners and users know the game isn't rigged against them, and it gets better. Caspa's development is completely open source and community-led. Anyone can view the code, contribute improvements, or propose new features. No secretive boardrooms making decisions behind closed doors. This openness creates long-term staying power because improvements come from a diverse group of contributors, not just one team that might lose interest or run out of funding. But here's where we start connecting all these dots. So pay close attention to reason number five because this is where everything comes together. Reason number five, growing minor and infrastructure support. Technology means nothing without adoption. A brilliant blockchain that nobody uses is just an expensive science experiment. Caspa is gaining serious traction where it counts. The hash rate, which measures computing power securing the network, keeps climbing steadily. Multiple mining pools now support KAS. Both ASIC miners and GPU miners are actively securing the chain, which means there's real economic investment happening. On the infrastructure side, more exchanges keep listing KAS, making it easier to buy. More wallets are adding support, making it easier to store. More tracking tools are launching, making it easier to monitor. This ecosystem growth creates a positive feedback loop. Better infrastructure attracts more users. More users attract more infrastructure. And this is essential for long-term survival in the blockchain space. Projects die when miners leave and infrastructure crumbles. Caspa is moving in the opposite direction, gaining momentum consistently. So let's bring this all together now. We've got blazing fast transaction speeds that work at the base layer. We've got proven security through proof-of-work enhanced by GhostDAG. We've got genuine scalability through BlockDAG architecture. We've got trust through a fair launch and open development. And we've got growing real-world support from miners and infrastructure providers. Each piece reinforces the others. Speed without security fails. Security without scalability limits growth. Scalability without trust creates skepticism. Trust without infrastructure stays theoretical. Caspa brings all these elements together in a way that very few projects manage. Now, should you buy Caspa? That's ultimately your decision, and I'm definitely not here to give you financial advice. I'm not your financial advisor, and you should absolutely do your own research and consult with qualified professionals before making any investment decisions. But I will say this, when you're looking at blockchain projects with genuine long-term potential, Caspa checks boxes that matter. Real technology that works today, not promises about what might work tomorrow. A fair foundation that builds trust instead of skepticism. Growing support that indicates sustainable momentum, not just hype. 
These are the fundamentals that separate serious projects from flash-in-the-pan trends. Keep watching Caspa's development, track the hash rate growth, monitor exchange listings and make informed decisions based on current data, not speculation. Before you go, do me a favor. If you found this breakdown valuable, hit that like button. It genuinely helps the channel reach more people who need this kind of clear, straightforward analysis. Subscribe if you haven't already because I'm constantly researching projects like this and breaking them down in ways that actually make sense. And hey, drop a comment below letting me know what you think about Caspa or, you know, what other projects you want me to analyze next. I read every single comment and your feedback really shapes what content I create. Plus, I've got tons of other videos on this channel covering different blockchain projects, market analysis, and crypto strategies. So, check out the playlist in the description, or just browse the channel. There's plenty more content to help you navigate this space with confidence. Thanks so much for sticking with me through this entire breakdown, I genuinely appreciate your time and attention. Until next time, stay informed, stay curious, and I'll catch you in the next video.